Hello, I am a week late with this one. I want to use, I was sick this weekend, so I want to be like, oh, hey, I was sick, what could I do? But uh, it was supposed to be out before this weekend, so that doesn't accomplish much. A lot of stuff happened, though, in all these many weeks since I've done this video. Um, I'm going to show you some of that. Still working on Dread Speed, very scary. I have a deadline for that, and I feel like, I mean... While I was sick, I made this list of things to do, which is about a third of... It's a list of uh, the different guns, helmets, and jetpacks ideas that, to implement. And uh, that's not even all the ones I need for the game. And that's just a small part of the total work of the game. So, pretty overwhelming for the amount of time I have left. And the worst part about it, the thing that's driving me nuts, is... I wish I hadn't taken the job, even though I really need the money, because I wanted to be working on NPC Quest and get that out, um, not not get it released, but be able to submit it to the IGF. I was really hoping to do that, and there's just no way. I'm going to be working on this right up to the IGF deadline, if I'm lucky, and it doesn't take even longer. So, that's the end of the ado. Let's head straight into some footage of Dread Speed. Okay, this is some artwork by, I don't know his name, I'm sorry, but a uh, guy who works at Boy's Life, so it's you know lets me have a cool title screen that I don't have to put any effort into. I'm going to have buttons down there, obviously, but right now they don't exist. And let's get in there and uh, check this out. The flashing OK button, that relates to your jetpack, which is kind of your smart bomb type item. Could be a bomb. In this case, it's not. It's a shield. Covers you with crystal stuff. Let me click it. BAM! Covered with crystals. Doesn't last very long, but if you use a higher level version of the item as you upgrade it with better junk, then you get to do that stuff. Uh, it'll last longer, it'll recharge faster. You can see it's recharging now, it's got one little green blip, and now it has two. So you can only use it every so often, and you know, you upgrade it to improve that. And look at that, that's the big scary boss. Uh, he's got a lot more stuff now than he used to. Um, there's numbers popping up when you shoot. That's my favorite thing in the world. And let's go back in there again. I have to talk about this after having filmed it, so it's kind of disorienting. You can see I have a blast buddy. That's what my helmet provides, that little red friend of mine who's shooting for me. It's kind of useless, but it's cute. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. Boss has a lot of parts. You can shoot the turrets off, and then that blows up the panel the turrets are on. And there's also a piece of armor plating. I just destroyed it there. Once you destroy it on both ends, then you can finally hurt the boss. Right now you can see his red eyes covered with gray. It uncovers and you can kill it. Okay. Well, that was kind of abrupt. I didn't film it blowing up, which is really exciting because it drops all the little goodies you need to collect to uh, build new weapons. But yeah, it's pretty solid now. We just need a uh, million times more content. Bosses, levels, weapons, there are several weapons you haven't seen, several different uh, helmets and stuff, but there's only, I think, three or four of each type of thing, so... Got a ways to go for the amount I actually need to have. I need 30-some, so... Here we go. I'm Batman.